In season one, Rocco and I, we were sizing each other up. We were waiting for some lens changes and stuff, and we have a cage. So we just kind of like hockey players, just threw the gloves down and just said, what's up? Are we going to do this or not? And so we did it. He got the best. <laughs> he got the better of me on that one. Background, Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu, grew up boxing. I've trained in, you know, wrestling. I've trained pretty much MMA all around. I don't know if you know who Vincent Rocco Vargas really is in his past. War hero. You know, you don't mess with war heroes. Okay, that's a that's the number one no-no in anybody's book. He's a war hero. All right, let's go this way. I was there. I got front, front row seats, man. I was up against the gate. First of all, Rocco, is a, he smiles a lot, but he smiles so he don't hurt you. You dig what I'm saying? You don't want to get him mad, but JD's quick, man. I ref that match, right? And then JD told me to jump in. I wasn't going to jump in. He's a army ranger, bro. That guy would live out in the woods like for like two weeks with just a knife, and he'll, he'll be okay. Then he's a big man. As long as he can't get a hold of you, I think you're gonna be squared away. Round two, baby. Round two. Get some. JD taking another shot at the title, I guess. <laughs> I'm ready, man. I just love being here. I love being with the guys and being a part of it. I don't know where I came off, though, as, as the bully. I've never taken anyone's lunch money or anything, but, uh, you know, I'll take it. Whatever. I have a lot of respect for Rocco, because Rocco's got an incredible stand-up. He is good at jiu-jitsu, so he could take me down. He's good at wrestling, so he could just really slam me to the floor. I admire the bravery of, of JD, but, you know, I, I wouldn't do it. That's when you have to use your head and say, no, that's not very smart. I'm not getting in the cage with you. With JD, you, you, can't, you can't not respect his physical stature. The guy's in shape. He's got, like, a 12-pack. <laughs> if you get anywhere near Rocco, just him breathing on you is going to knock you down, man. JD's weight is what Rocco curls with, you know what I'm talking about? I don't know. I feel uh, anywhere he wants to take it, I feel comfortable. <laughs> so I think this time around, when he comes in, I'm probably just going to kick his knee out. I'll write my will first, though, before we get into it. <laughs> We're here right now. Let the best man win. You know, these are both my boys, but we got to get it done. It's going to go down right now. Well, he's been talking all this trash all season long. Because he got lucky, because I couldn't hit him. It's to put him on his back, he's done. Make him tap, he's done. To death, I'm sorry the show's over, fellas, because he's done. Let's go! Get it on! Got it! Go! Let's go! There you go. Go! Up the ball! Up the ball! Oh! 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 <laughs> here you go. 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 Here you go.